Hi, I'm Cynthia. And I'm Chris. And we're the Hanye family. Okay, we're going to do a uh, can of a, kind of a both a suggestion and a Canada group, Canadian content, as it were. And uh, this one's going to be from uh, my cousin, Bruce, Bruce Richardson. And uh, the song is My Room by Eric's Trip. Uh, I read up Eric's Trip is actually from Moncton, New Brunswick. And you know, I'd like to uh, listen to bands from uh, down east sometimes just to, you know, give them some flavor, I suppose, and give them some recognition. Yeah. So we're going to check them out. Hope you guys do too. Yes, of course. Yeah, this is Eric's <clears throat> Trip. think so far <laughs> it's very punk <laughs> is that what you call it because all i hear is noise in my ears from like i don't know maybe it's how it's recorded i don't know the but the guitars are just yeah, annoying my ears the distortion on the guitars is at full yeah like, i thought so it's very annoying on my ears. Um, yeah. On top of that, the singing is too subdued for that type of music in the first place, in my opinion. Yeah. I. You feel it sounds kind of lazy? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. That's a good word for it. Mm. Um, sorry, I'm not enjoying it, but that's, yeah, yeah, that's no. my opinion. I do, I, it's really bothering me. I do hear a few influences, uh, some B-52 in there, some probably some Green Day. Uh, I don't know that much about the, the punk scene, so you could, you know, tell me whatever other groups are, are involved or uh, influencing is. this. But uh, I find, I don't know if it's the recording, they could have gone without pressing those guitars so high on the mix. Like It's hard to listen to. But, you know, you can hear the distortion. Like, they're compressed right to the edge. And all you're hearing is that guttural thing. Uh other bands, like uh, for instance, Green Day, when they do their heavy guitars, and they have heavy guitars, yeah, they don't overextend them. They don't push them to the edge of their ability. They just kind of they play them and they play them loud, but they don't. Um, yeah, I can usually handle some Green Day. This, well, not this, so much. This goes right to full blast, like full. But then on top of that, in comparison, Green Day also has a singer that's much stronger. Yeah, no, he's yell he's willing to yell and and really get over the song. But so, anyway, we you know. we should finish this. All right. <laughs>
I don't get it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't understand the pause in the middle and then scream at you again. And it's like, what? Yeah. Sorry. Um, no. It's... it's it's got kind of a, a, um amateurish quality about it. Um, it's very well, like I can hear, I mean, they have, they have structure and they have all this stuff, but that guitar is just too much on yeah. the thing. And when they mix out of it and go into that soft part, it's so jarring. Uh, it's like they didn't use crossfaders or anything. They just kind of went. Uh, yeah, it's, sorry. I don't care for that at all. I'm sorry, but that's just not at all for me. Nope, yeah. not my taste. It's like they, it's, it was done on cheap and you can tell. Uh, then it was done loudly. Uh, the, the snare was really bright. It was a little too bright. Oh. Almost like you could hear, what's, how to explain it? Like you could hear it hit, like, Pah! yeah, you know? it's, it, the music was far too much and not recorded properly, I don't think. And the vocals were far too little and just, I, it didn't work for me at all. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. But thank you anyway for the suggestion. We do appreciate it. We always want to check out new stuff. Mm -hmm. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Click that notification bell if you don't want to miss a video. Like and share with all your family and friends. And we'll see you next time. Later. Later. Mm -hmm.